In today's video, I wanted to do another paper towel swipe. I was inspired by some other posts that I saw on Facebook that um, did some swipes like this and I wanted to try it out. I have black for my base coat and then I have copper, dark blue, and light blue. And I'm going to be trying for a flower shape, swiping out from one side to the other side of the canvas while leaving a little bit of negative space for the middle of the flower. So to help make cells, I did add Floetrol to each of my paints. Um, I also have water to thin them down. And then I have a little bit of black paint mixed with Australian Floetrol and water, which I've found for other techniques and recipes. The Australian Floetrol creates a lot of cells, so I'm just going to use that as my swiping color. I'm just taking some of my black paint and putting it down as a base coat on my canvas, and then I'll start adding my other colors. So as you can see with the copper, I just started putting it down kind of on a half circle um, so that the black will still be visible right in the middle area. Once I had the copper down, I then started adding my dark blue and my light blue. I took my paper towel. Um, this was damp with water. I run it under the faucet and then just wring out most of the water so it's not dripping wet, but it is damp and I find that the um, wet paper towel works well for swipes. I just tore it up into smaller pieces so that I could have a little bit more control while I was swiping. And I put some of my black paint down that I was going to use as my swiping color just on my table so that I could dip my paper towel right into it. I then just started on um, one edge of the painting and just started swiping the copper out. It takes just a minute or two, but the cells really started popping and I found that um, for some reason that light blue had amazing cells all throughout the piece. And I didn't um, really get my color to swipe out as far as I wanted it to. Um, it kind of stopped about halfway through the canvas. So next time I'll probably add more paint or use a heavier swiping tool to help drag the paint out. But as you can see, those cells are really, really great. And you can keep swiping as much as you want. Um, I did add a little bit more copper. It was kind of lost under the black. And then I actually just started swiping the copper over the other colors in a few spots to kind of keep that color in it. So instead of turning out like a flower design like I was hoping for, um, it actually kind of looked like an eyeball. <laughs> it was just a very interesting design. It was fun. Uh, there are a ton of cells in this. So that Australian Floetrol and black paint mixture worked really well for creating cells. I still have quite a bit of leftover paint, so I'm just going to do a dirty pour on some coasters um, with these colors, because I think these colors are really, really beautiful. I just put some of my black base paint down, and then I used a small cup and poured a little bit of each of my colors in them and then did a dirty pour across uh, each of the wood circles and then I just tilted out the design. Overall, I think the colors are great. Uh, the blues and the copper are all metallics, so I got a really shimmery feel to them. I think this swipe technique has a lot of potential. I will just need to practice what I am doing and hopefully get 
more of a flower design next time instead of the eyeball but it still dried really well and i think it was really fun to try out and the colors were great and those cells were just amazing so i will try this again Let me know what you think down in the comments below. If you'd like to see more swipes like this, let me know what colors you'd like to see. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I do put out three videos a week and so I will see you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching.